expressing square roots of negative numbers as imaginary numbers using i. We know that by definition, i equals the square root of negative 1. First example, the square root of negative 2. That equals the square root of 2 times the square root of negative 1, which equals the square root of 2 times i. Again, the square root of negative 1 equals i. Let's do another example. The square root of negative 25 equals the square root of 25 times the square root of negative 1. The square root of 25 equals 5. The square root of negative 1 equals i. One more example. The square root of negative a to the third b to the fourth. That equals the square root of a to the third b to the fourth times the square root of negative one. Now in order to simplify I'm going to rewrite these powers as powers of two. So a cubed can be written as a squared times a. b to the fourth can be written as b squared times b squared. We bring down the square root of negative 1. So now I can pull out this a, this b, and this b outside the radical. So I have a on the outside, two b's, which gives me b squared. Under the radical, I'm just left with a, and the square root of negative 1 is i.